Hi everybody, I have a project to share with you today. We are using this book called Explore Honeybees with 25 Great Projects by Cindy Blobaum and today we're going to do the Barbed Stinger Project. It's super easy and you probably have these materials at home already. All you need is some tissue paper and some chipboard or even cardboard would do as well. You just want it to be nice and sturdy. I'm going to divide this up into four sections so that I can do both stingers as well as my son. So the first stinger is super easy. It's just a tall triangle. And for the second one, you want to make it barbed. So it's, again, really easy to hand draw this. And I did this example for my son to copy, and he did his fabulous. We're going to take a look at the way he's drawing his here. And then the only thing that you have to do which is kind of annoying is to cut it out I would recommend just using scissors versus using uh, an exacto knife so this is the project it's super simple just hold your tissue paper and stab it with the stinger we did the barbed stinger first and it got caught which is supposed to represent how when a drone bee stings something then it dies because the stinger comes off so now we're going to do it again with the other stinger. This represents the queen bee stinger, and you can see it slides right in and comes right out. All right, so now it's my turn because I like doing these projects also. So I went ahead and tried it with the queen bee stinger first, and it came right out. And now I'm going to try the barb stinger, and you can see that it totally gets caught. This project was super simple, very educational, and super affordable as well. If you want to catch up on some of the other projects that we're doing with this unit study, you can click on the screen. And if you want to see what we're doing on a more regular daily basis, you can find me on Instagram at Pepper and Pine.